Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I've got some goodies here that I picked up on our trip to Chicago that we just got home from. Now this box of cookies, these macarons, actually were from my house, but I counted it as being part of our vacation because I got them and ate them when we, right when we got home. So I decided to add these along with all these little goodies that I got from our trip in Chicago, which I was thinking of making into some sort of journal or something. So the first thing that you can see here is a bag from Bertillo's, which as you see, it has hot dogs. They also have all kinds of other things to eat that are very delicious. I myself got a beef, or not a beef sandwich, my husband got a beef sandwich, I got a fish sandwich. And then I decided to keep this along with all the other goodies that I got that normally would be thrown away by most normal people. For instance, every receipt that I got, I kept, at least not, if not ever, every one of them, many of them. And then there's little bags and there's photographs that I took that I printed out. This is actually upside down. I actually put these in order of date. Um, I've got some receipts, some tea bag wrappers that I drank tea from, some cookies that we had bought. This is a bag that held, I'll show you. See how long it is? It held the silverware from when we went to Cracker Barrel in Springfield, Missouri. And I just messed up my order of things. So I'm not gonna go through all these things right now. Um, let's see, which way did they go? Something like this. And I can put them back in order. But what I wanted to show you was all these little receipts and maps and some of them are key cards from the hotel we stayed, hotels we stayed in. And uh, I wanted to utilize somehow or another this bag to make it into a journal cover and kind of think maybe I wanted to make this into an outer cover because this isn't very sturdy. So this is just some of the ideas I have for making the trip that we took into something memorable. So far, I don't have a whole lot of grand ideas, um, but some of these are some of the materials that I have. This also came from the box of cookies, and these are the delicious cookies that I ate from there. My husband is not a fan of macarons, so I'm able to eat the whole box myself. Yeah. Another thing that I got, a folder of goodies from my aunt. So this, this is all absolute junk that I saved and kept from our trip. And this is some stuff that she gave me from her stash of goodies. She gave me this artist booklet, little sketchbook, which is great because it has all these old yellowed pages in there. And another thing that's in here, I'll just take everything out and show you what she gave me. Okay, so this here is a little tiny notebook that I made and I gave to her years ago, or actually I think it was a year ago, and then she gave it back to me along with these little art things that she drew and painted in here, which I thought was just magnificent, but her art is just so adorable and the fact that she utilized one of my little craft things just really made me happy. So here we also have some... Uh, parchment cardstock just a few different colors they're pastel colors and really pretty and what is this this is oh some homemade paper that just there's not a whole lot here but there's a, a few sheets that I'm afraid I may hoard because they're just beautiful pieces of homemade paper there's a description on the back that tells you how you can do it. Hold that recycled paper thought. Uh, talks about how you can use this. I'm glad that they did this because I'm not always sure what I can do. So it, 
it says you can cut it into collages, make greeting cards, use it like any other paper. Each piece is, piece is handmade and so on and so forth. So that's super cool. And then another thing that was in this package was this really neat, I don't even know what it is, some sort of really thin paper. It looks like it might be handmade paper too, but it's, it's really nice. And one of them even has a painting on it that I'm not sure if my aunt made or if it was just in there from when she got it or not. But so these are some other goodies that I could utilize as a part of a documented journal from my trip. So I'm excited about use, utilizing these things, but what I need are ideas. What can I do to create something very beautiful and precious out of this junk and these pretty papers that I have inherited from my dear aunt? Um, if anybody has any, any ideas on what I can do, please leave them in the comments below. If uh, you'd like to see any other content, please like and subscribe to my channel and you'll be sure to be notified of all things if you hit the notification bell and you'll be able to see any of the things that I do make and hope you enjoy them. So anyway, I just wanted to share this for right now and if I do anything with this, I will let you know, but I'm open to suggestions of any kind. Thank you so much for being here and please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. All right. Thank you. Bye.